because sometimes people will show their friends their art or certain people things and they just feel like they suck because they keep showing people things and not getting the reactions that they're showing but maybe you're just showing the wrong people so that's something i learned too that you gotta there really is such things as different artists like oh bad people say good crowd tonight bad crowd tonight and you know so i know also like you know different groups uh, you know and different ethnicity groups also are different audiences oh, yeah. and at the end of the day though would you agree that funny is funny despite the various audiences that are out there yeah funny is funny like i can you can you, i can have someone going up i can i can see a comedian go up and be like you didn't make me laugh and i didn't find you funny but funny is funny and i know you're funny right like you can right. hear a song and you may not like the song but you still got to give props and respect to the talent so i agree completely I may not find you funny, but funny is funny. And I got to, wherever, wherever props are due, I'll give them. Absolutely, man. Sometimes you hate, like, giving credit to people who are funny at certain times, but hey. Oh, yeah. I, and I, I, but I also, one of the reasons that made me smile <laughs> is because I love when I make someone laugh at something that they don't want to laugh at. <laughs> Damn it, you got me. That's my whole comedy philosophy. My, I remember one time, I forget what I was doing. I was going for a walk or, was I going for a walk? I forget. But I, re- I think I was going for a nightly walk because I didn't want to run because my legs hurt. So I was like, I'll walk instead. <laughs> and on the walk, I was thinking about comedy and I was thinking about jokes. And I forgot how I came there, but this this epiphany helped me out. And I think it's important to figure out like, hey, why do we do art? What draws us? Like, because I was, oh, that's what I was trying to figure out. I was trying to figure out what my comedic style is. Because mm-hmm. every everyone has a style eventually to develop one when they're doing art. And I hadn't quite, like, I know I had one. And people kind of like, oh, you have a very calm sense of humor. So I was like, how do I get there? Like, what is my creative process? And I realized part of how I make jokes is I think of something horrible that you shouldn't laugh at. And then I think, how do I get people to laugh at this? So that's my whole thing. It's just like, let me think of like a horrible joke or a horrible topic that you shouldn't joke about or laugh at. How can I take that and make it funny? So whenever, which is kind of different than what we're saying, because sometimes people are like corny or a different kind of humor that you don't like, they still make you laugh. You're like, damn, like that wasn't offensive or anything, but like you got me to laugh even though I didn't like. I don't want to give you the satisfaction, um, which is something I do to my friends all the time. Mm-hmm. Like, I always try to see funny things that'll make them laugh because I love the look of defeat in their face when they laugh at something they don't want to laugh at. That's something that like I'm known for. Like that's one of those things that I do. Like I'll say something to my friends, and um, they try not to. Like I love when I see someone trying not to smile. Because they know if they smile or laugh that I'm going to do it again. Because um, it's that, what's the word? Validation. If I get that validation, I'm like, oh, I'm going to keep doing this thing. But I'm off. We I'm got off you the there. We put it through. That's, again, that's the big win in making people laugh. And that's why you're just so damn funny. Even just the way you tell your stories and little, you know, little snippets in there. I think it's awesome. I think it's really cool. Yeah.